makapigil hiningang ganda ng Kamalig Bypass Road formal ng binuksan sa mga motorista. Yan at iba pang mga naglalakihang proyekto sa kabikulan. Panuorin at alamin. The Bypass Road with the world's most perfect cone in the full view is now officially open to the riding public by no less than the Secretary of the Department of Public Works and Highways, Mark Villiar, on June 15, 2021. The construction of Kamalig Bypass Road in Kamalig Albay aims to provide safe, convenient, and faster access for tourists and other road users without passing through the town proper of Kamalig, thus will decongest traffic along the Ang Maharlika Highway. Barangay Salugan, Tulibud, part of the Ang Maharlika is 2.56 kilometers, whereas distance of said barangays along Kamalig Bypass Road is 3.5 kilometers. This road is longer in distance but shorter if we consider its travel time. DPWH Region 5 Regional Director Virgilio Eduarte said at the ceremonial event that during rush hours, motors can save more or less 25 minutes travel time from Salugan to Libod and vice versa when using the bypass road. On regular days, 15 minutes travel time will be reduced to 5 minutes. Also, when there are roadway improvements or repairs or even events in the town proper, traffic is usually hampered for 40 to 50 minutes. And this will be reduced to 5 minutes if motorists will traverse the Kamalig Bypass Road. And with its 4-lane well-lit road, travelers can expect a smooth flow and convenient travel. The said road encompasses 5 barangays of Municipality of Kamali, Barangay Salugan, Kirangay, Suwa, Ilawud, and Barangay Lipot. This new road serves both to bolster local economy and help promote tourism, where Kamali is the heritage town of Albay and the emerging transportation hub adjacent to Bicol International Airport. Added to all of this is the panoramic view of majestic Payon Volcano where everyone can feast their eyes on when Her Majesty is devoid of clouds to block her beauty. Other ongoing DPWH road development projects in Bicol region includes the 3.1 km Ligaster Coastal Road Extension, the 52.4 km Batan Island Circumferential Road, the 15 km Albay Sursigon Connector, and the 2.5 billion Daraga Urban Tourism Eco Route Highway. Meanwhile, another big ticket project that will boost Bicol Region's tourism and economic potential is the Bicol International Airport. The construction of the Bicol International Airport is now ongoing 24 7 to reach its target completion date of June 2021. Dubbed as the most scenic gateway, with the Mayon Volcano, which serves as the perfect backdrop for this new airport. With the Bicol International Airport's opening, the transport, tourism, and economy of the region will surely push forward. Once completed, the Bicol International Airport will replace the currently operating Ligaspi Airport and will be serving as the newest hub and gateway to the Bicol region. This project, which cost 4.8 billion pesos covers the construction of landside facilities in other buildings, the construction of the passenger terminal building and runway extension, construction of taxiway, drainage, and other site development works, which commence in 2016. BOTR announced that the Bicol International Airport project is now 82.21% complete as of May 2021 and is set to be inaugurated by September this year. Another world-class travel facility and is considered as a mega-tourism project will soon to rise in Bicol region. 
the Gaspe City Albay will have its first international cruise ship terminal. As construction finally started after the groundbreaking ceremony on Tuesday with DPWH officials. The ICST project is another welcome addition to the infrastructure development that will uplift the tourism industry in the city by boosting the arrivals from different countries in the world. The project includes the construction of seaport that can accommodate a standard 300 meter long tourism cruise ship, the construction of all facilities including the 250 million terminal building for Bicos first international cruise port that costs 920 million pesos and target to be completed in 2023. Once operational, Legazpi will be the second city after Tagbilaran City in Bohol to have international passenger cruise ship terminal. Situated in Barangay Dapdap Legazpi City beside Dakapuntukan Hill, the ICST is expected to attract more tourists because of its strategic location that offers a perfect view of the cone-shaped Mayun volcano. This world-class facility will contribute to the enhancement of the tourism industry in the central Philippines and will spur economic activities not only in Albay but in the entire Bicol region. What do you think about these infrastructure developments in Bicol region? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell.